you can, by all means, think of a framework laptop as you would a regular PC. All of its components, no matter how small or seemingly unimportant, can be swapped out. If something happens to malfunction, any possible part of it, you can easily and without much effort order a replacement from Frameworks Marketplace and then, with similar ease, replace the part yourself. It's a true, plug-and-play, solution and, needless to say, it works flawlessly. All of this means that you, the end consumer and owner of the laptop, are in control. You only need to buy the laptop once and then, over time, you'll simply replace the parts that warrant replacing, or upgrading, for that matter. Everything is replaceable. You can swap out the battery, display, antenna module, buy additional fastener kits, heatsinks and fan kits, hinges, power adapters, speakers, touchpads, Wi-Fi cards, bottom and top cover kits, fingerprint readers, webcam modules, and so on and so forth. Heck, you can even customize the color of the bezel. This level of repairability is unheard of. Should anything malfunction, you won't need to send it in for repair, to have it inspected by a third party, or to wait weeks if not months for it to come back. You can do everything yourself within just a couple of minutes. Framework also has incredibly detailed and user-friendly tutorials, so no particular tech savviness is required. Swappable I.O. All 13 inches Framework laptops come with four expansion slots, two on each side. This means that you can alter their selection of ports within a matter of seconds. These include swappable storage, up to 1 terabyte at the time of this writing, USB-C ports, DisplayPort, Ethernet, HDMI, microSD, USB-A, and a 3.5mm headphone jack. You can swap out these expansion cards at will. Need 4 USB-C ports for whatever reason? It's doable. Want something a bit more versatile and diverse? That, too, can be assembled. No external dongles or hubs are necessary as you can easily set things up to your liking. This aspect alone makes framework laptops an absolute joy to work with as they can adapt to your needs and preferences. Everything can be repurposed. Let's say you're sporting a 12th gen Intel CPU and want to switch to an AMD Ryzen 7000 series. All you need to do is buy the appropriate mainboard, open up the laptop, make the necessary replacement, put the bottom cover back in its place, tighten a few screws, and you're ready to boot. Are framework laptops worth it? Absolutely. They're an incredible option for anyone who's in the market for a thin and light ultrabook. They're not perfect, though, the top lid isn't all that firm, the default hinges aren't stupendously tight, and the battery life isn't great, Intel is to blame, but, overall, it's quite an alluring package. 3 to 2 display, over 400 nits of brightness, 2256 x 1505 resolution, 100% coverage of the sRGB color gamut, 1.5 mm of key travel, stellar Linux support, up to 64 GB of user replaceable RAM, a built in fingerprint reader, Wi Fi 6E, Bluetooth 5.2, up to 8 TB of storage, and so on and so forth. All of that is in a laptop that weighs a mere 1.3 kilos. A stellar package, all things considered. What makes framework laptops so unique? They're unique because they offer a level of repairability that no other manufacturer or OEM can match. They're built in such a way to allow for endless tinkering and, perhaps best of all, not a single component is soldered onto the motherboard, other than the CPU, which means that you can swap things out and upgrade to your heart's content. That's another key selling point, framework laptops can easily be upgraded whenever the need arises. Moreover, should any component malfunction, you can just order a replacement part online, swap it out yourself and be up and running in no time. Is there a Ryzen framework laptop? There finally is. And, perhaps best of all, it's the 7000 series. We're talking about the most efficient line of processors on the market, with Zen 4 cores and integrated RDNA 3 graphics, ones that can easily trade blows with dedicated, entry-level GPUs of the past. This, in addition to mind-blowing battery life, means that the Ryzen-based framework laptop is the only one worth considering. Intel SKUs don't offer nearly as good of an experience. Over to you. Are you as hyped for framework laptops as the rest of us? Would you ever buy such a laptop and, if not, why not? Let us know in the comment section down below and, in case you need any help, head over to our forum and ask away. Why don't other companies make upgradable laptops? Creating upgradable laptops only serves the end consumer, not the OEM. If you were to buy just a single laptop and then, say, upgrade the CPU every few years, then your finances would essentially be out of reach. By creating closed-off ecosystems, by soldering as many components to the motherboard as possible, and by offering no repairability options whatsoever, OEMs are essentially forcing their customers to buy a new laptop within three to five years, if not even sooner. 
Companies like Intel, AMD, and Nvidia are also trying their hardest to come up with shiny new bells and whistles for the public to yearn for, alluring additions that can only be attained by upgrading. They want their customers to be happy and satisfied for a period of time. The shorter the period, the bigger the profit. Conclusion. Framework laptops are a veritable revolution and, much like any other revolution in the past, it's not without its quirks. Still, the proposition at hand is about as tremendous as it gets, and it serves us the most. We all stand to gain by supporting such an endeavor. Moreover, Framework, as a company, not only listens to feedback but also tries its hardest to bring down as many barriers as it possibly can. Heck, all design schematics along with in-depth documentation can be found on GitHub. Everyone's invited to join in the fun and create their own custom designs and modules and what have you. Once that's done, you both have an upgraded laptop and a main board that's no longer being used. It doesn't have to go to waste, though, because, well, why should it? You can simply purchase an external case for $39, co-developed with Cooler Master, and, with some slight tinkering, make yourself a small form factor PC. You are making an additional investment by buying a new main board, but you're not letting anything go to waste. Framework Laptop 16 A 16 inches version of the Framework Laptop is what a lot of people have been waiting and clamoring for. A bigger chassis means it'll be able to contain much more powerful components, offer even more customizability, 6 expansion slots instead of 4, and, perhaps most surprisingly, the option to add another expansion module on the back. That one's a real game changer, though, as it's essentially a configurable PCIe X8 interface and can, therefore, be harnessed in a myriad of different ways. Additional M.2 slots, video capture cards, swappable GPU modules, external batteries, and so on and so forth. The possibilities are endless, and it's fair to say that this addition only further strengthens Framework's claim to fame. Heck, even the deck of the laptop allows for an insane level of customizability. You can move the keyboard to the side and add an optional numpad or, conversely, replace the existing strips with ones imbued with addressable LED lights. The possibilities are endless. All of this screams potential, and, if things pan out as expected, the 16 inches framework laptop might become an incredibly alluring option once it hits the market later this year. The option to add, or swap out, an entire GPU on the back will no doubt serve as a tremendous boon to both creatives and gamers. And, should you need to upgrade, you'll be able to buy a next-gen graphics module, one sporting, say, an NVIDIA RTX 5000 series GPU, and continue with your work, or play, without having to upgrade the entire laptop.